the founder and pastor of the Bethel Family Worship Center and author of Elephants in the Church. Bishop George Bloomer is with us. Yeah, tell us, I, I, tell I, us about the meeting. What did you think of the meeting? Well, it, it was, um, it was uh, this is my fourth time meeting with him. It, it, was, uh, it was a great meeting. So, so Bishop Bloomer, it sounded to me like it was a two and a half hour waste of time. <laughs> well, that's what it sounds like to you. If you didn't get me, it took me all of it took me all of a second, a minute ago, to tell you that in that meeting there was no substance that came out of it. It was, a, it was a great meeting. I went to the meeting this time to raise a question about some of the things that's been happening on a campaign, uh, the racial issue. And I was going to raise the question to, to talk to him about that. Uh, for a half an hour to 40 minutes, we discussed that that, that, that issue. And how did you feel after it? I felt good about that. I, I, I was okay with what, you know, his answers to what we had put. But could, could... I spent a half an hour trying to press that and try and try and try and, and I did not get a an apology. And how'd you feel after it? I felt good about that. And so we need to get a, 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 a statement from, from, from Donald Trump on how is he going to deal with our issues and uh, what does he have to say to us and... And how'd you feel after it? I felt good about that. I don't know enough about the political process I don't know him well enough to give him my endorsement, and I believe that you're being tried by the fire, and the fire has not consumed you, and that's where I am. It's time now for us to have somebody that can bring some jobs to this nation and look out for the Christians, our spiritual and Christian rights, and I'm sold with you on that. You know I am. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. I don't know him well enough to give him my endorsement, and the fire has not consumed you. I don't know him well enough to give him my endorsement, and I'm sold with you on that. You know I am. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. I just want to thank you. I want to thank both of you, and in particular, I'll tell you what, it's been... And how'd you feel after it? I felt good about that.